properties of aldehydes and ketones first member formaldehyde formaldehyde is the first member of aldehydes formaldehydes they are gas at room temperature okay gas at room temperature next acetaldehyde acetaldehyde is a volatile liquid acetaldehyde is a volatile liquid next other lower members of aldehydes and ketones are colorless liquids okay next lower aldehyde their smell lower aldehydes have pungent smell okay as the size of the molecule increases their odor becomes less pungent and they become more fragrant okay next ketones ketones have sweet odor okay ketones have sweet odor these are the important physical properties of their smell and their states of matter okay next is polarity what about polarity we know aldehydes and ketones contains carbonyl group and carbonyl group is polar in nature okay so they have dipole bonds okay they contain carbonyl groups this carbonyl group is polar in nature and carbon is having a slight positive charge and oxygen is having slight negative charge okay so they are polar in nature and they have dipole moments as a result they have high boiling points okay they have high boiling points compared to hydrocarbons of comparable size hydrocarbons and ethers okay hydrocarbon and ethers of comparable size okay but they are less they have less boiling point compared to alcohols okay because alcohols are having intermolecular hydrogen bonding there is no such intermolecular hydrogen bonding in the case of aldehydes and ketone so they are having less boiling points compared to alcohols next what about the solubility solubility lower members are soluble in water due to the ability to form hydrogen bonds they can form hydrogen bonds okay like this as the size of the alkyl part increases solubility decreases so take this c double bond o h they can form hydrogen bonding like this okay and in the case of ketones also they can form hydrogen bonding so lower members are soluble in water due to the formation of this hydrogen bonding okay as the alkyl part increases solubility also decreases okay they are soluble in organic solvents okay this much about the physical properties of aldehydes and ketones okay chemical properties of aldehydes and ketones in the case of aldehydes and ketones both contains carbonyl group so most of the reactions are similar okay so they contain carbonyl groups this carbon is having slight positive charge and oxygen is having slight negative charge so nucleophiles can come and attack on the carbon atom okay like this nucleophile attack carbon atom and form an al alkoxide compound like this alkoxide ion okay this is the slowest step and the rate determining step 
next step proton will attack on this o minus okay this is the fast step and the product obtained will be like this this is the addition nucleophilic addition product obtained this is neutral here this carbon is having sp2 hybridized and during the formation of an addition product the uh, hybridization changes to sp3 hybridized first nucleophilic attack takes place and in the alkoxide tetrahedral alkoxide is obtained this on protonation gets converted into the neutral addition product okay now next the reactivity what about the reactivity okay reactivity depends upon the presence of alkyl part okay presence of alkyl parts as the alkyl group increases what will happen reactivity also decreases okay reactivity decreases as the alkyl part increases and aldehydes are more reactive than ketones aldehydes are more reactive than ketones okay okay so in this case we can see that this contains alkyl group okay so due to plus i effect due to plus i effect as the alkyl part increases the reactivity uh, the this becomes less uh, positive okay in this case we can say that due to plus i effect due to plus i effect alkyl group is present the releases electrons and the carbon atom becomes less positive or their nucleophilicity decreases okay so the nucleophilic addition also decreased so nucleophilic addition decreases or the reactivity decreases okay in the case of ketones it contains more number of alkyl groups so due to steric hindrance nucleophilicity decreases also okay so more alkyl part is present okay nucleophilic addition also decreases okay so the order of reactivity will be as follows order of reactivity hcho is more reactive than ch3cho which is more reactive than ch3coch3 okay which is more reactive than ch3coc2h5 etc so this will be the reactivity order now what will be in the case of aromatic compounds aromatic compounds are less reactive than aliphatic compounds okay aromatic compounds are less reactive than aliphatic compounds this is due to plus r effect okay due to plus r effect or resonance effect in the case of aromatic compounds we can see that it contains benzene ring okay benzene ring okay as a result of this benzene ring it increases the electron density of carbon atom okay increases electron density of the carbonyl carbon atom okay electron density of carbon atom present in the carbonyl group this can be explained by the resonance structures different resonance structures of aldehyde benzaldehyde will be like this C double bond to H, okay. The positive charge O minus H, okay. Now next.
ओके नेक्स्ट केस पॉजिटिव चार्ज ओके नाउ ओके दीज आर द डिफरेंट रेसनेटिंग स्ट्रक्चर्स ऑफ बैंड सैल्टीहाइड ओके सो वी कैन सी दैट द इलेक्ट्रॉन डेंसिटी Uh, due to this uh, presence of electron density of the benzene ring this carbon is having less uh, positive character so the reactivity will be less than in the case of aliphatic compounds okay